Hello everyone, this is Joseph K. Welcome back to more Let's Play Tales of the Abyss 100%. In the last part, we got even further into Eldrin, and we have some difficulty. Now, what sucks about this save state is it doesn't take you back right away. So, I don't like that. But it does, however, heal you. So, that is a good uh, thing to keep in mind. And I'm over here wondering, you know what? Yeah, let's do it. Let's put Anis in and replace a Jade. Just to see if we can get some interesting dialogue. If we get some interesting dialogue, I'll, sh I'll show it off, but... Let's give Jade a rest. None of these enemies here really have any elemental weaknesses. And anyways, there's a lot you can do. Explore, but you know what? What sucks about the exploration is there's not much you can do with the exploration. Fine, fine. Don't let me use the field of phone on. Yeah, I wish they would have put a little bit more stuff into the exploration. But come over here, we get a phonic bracelet. I don't think that does anything. No, it doesn't look like it's anything it's spectacular. Yeah, I don't even know where the Fonda bracelet is. It might be one of those things that only the guys can equip. I don't know, it's weird. Let it be, it's not important. Hey, I come over here and fight this thing. And then just take a couple extra steps this way and we will get a scene. This is... What is it, guy? This is my... Doesn't look like much of a manor. It really is. It's the remains of my manor. Yeah, that's not really a manor guy. What? Really? This is a replica of Hod. I suppose it shouldn't be surprising. So this really is hard. Would you rather not fight Master Van? It's not that. I never thought I'd be able to come back. It's a strange feeling. Yes. This is the first time I've ever been to my homeland. I can't bring myself to hate Favicree. I think it could actually do some wonderful things. That applies to everything. Any tool can be used for wonderful or foolish things. Even the score. Luke. Yeah, I think so, too. I think maybe Yulia didn't mean for the world to follow the score exactly. But Yulia hid the seventh phone stone, which has the score of destruction written on it. People can't stay calm when faced with a score foretelling their death. Yulia wanted us to overturn the score? That's it. The seventh phonic hymn. What? I just remembered the first time I ever learned phonic hymns from Van. He said Yulia wished for people to overturn the score. Yulia loved the world. The phonic hymns are the pact that Yulia offered to Lorelei out of that love. Van was trying to fulfill Yulia's will by rebuilding the world. But Lorelei doesn't approve of Van's intent. That's why it's remained dormant within him. I see. If the phonic hymns are the symbol of the trust between Lorelei and Yulia, then the melody of the phonic hymns may awaken Lorelei. Van was controlling Lorelei by force, 
But if Lorelei were to awaken, even Van would need to concentrate on Lorelei to prevent neural contamination. Leaving him vulnerable. He might also lose the ability to use Lorelei's power. Tear! You have to see! Yeah, Tear. If the phonic hymns awaken Lorelei, we can use the key to free it. But I wonder if I can. I just now remembered the seventh one. I'm not sure if I have the melody, feeling, and lyrics correct. Pause! You remember before where she said that you don't even have to have the melody and feeling and whatever? Earlier in the game, if you know all seven hymns, you can sing them all, and that's called the Grand Phonic Kim. So what is she questioning herself for right here? You've remembered all the other ones correctly so far. Don't worry. I know you can sing it. And it's not like we have time to stop and worry about it. I'll give it a try. There is no try. There is do or do not. And Tyr gets the Phonic Hymn Master title. I think what I'll do in the next Let's Play, or I should say the long play, is I'll get a title, and I'll tell you what each title does. But anyways, we get a skit after that scene. I'm glad you remember the seventh phonic hymn. Yes, I can't believe I ever forgot it. Van always sang it to me as a lullaby. Now you'd be able to sing the grand phonic hymn as well. Together with the key of Lorelei, we can awaken Lorelei. I will awaken Lorelei with the grand phonic hymn. And I will draw Lorelei from Master Van into the sword. Right, then maybe we can fight evenly with him. Even so, we'll have to be careful. He is Van, after all. Yeah, true. Yeah, I know. I know Master Van's strength better than anyone. Luke, let's free Lorelei together. Yeah. Now, come in this um, lovely manner we just had a scene with. Open up this chest, and we get a phonic hat. Now, I'm going to actually backtrack and go back to the healing save point. So, we'll see. if this is not the enemy I'm looking for, we'll cut. Enemies. And it is the High Knight Replica 2, I believe. This is the last new enemy of the soldiers we're looking for. There is an issue though. I am low on stuff and I'm going to need to go back and restock. Which I'll probably end up doing. Between this episode and the next episode actually. But right here we have the High Knight replica. It doesn't have anything you can steal and that you can't. doesn't drop anything. Just wanted to clarify that. Sorry, I had to itch my ear. So, this is probably going to be the party I use for the final battle. I'm curious how that even got. That's what I've not heard yet. <laughs> I'm glad that battle was going to be left in. I went quiet because I was trying to hear what was going to be said. I'm just running back to get health. That's it. 
Uh, this episode is going to be long, too. I wouldn't be surprised if this one gets close to the 40-minute range. Anyways, come up here, and before you go any further, we want to come over here and get a couple things. First off, we want to open up this treasure chest, and we get a Phonic Crest. Then, head up this little area, come over here, open this, we get a special gel. Now, the next thing I'm going to do might seem kind of silly. Maybe not. I don't know. We're going to run back and we're going to save. I thought there was something over here. Well, it just goes to show they could have put so much more into this area. Because there's so much you can explore and it's lacking. Um, there shouldn't be any other enemies, so I'm going to go ahead and do this. Oh, you know what that means. Anyways, let's save real quick and I will be right back. Alright, y'all back. Yeah, I think we'll use this party. And this will probably be the party I keep the rest of the uh, game. Now, just keep going forward, and eventually you're going to get a skin. Uh, not a skin, but a seat. We brought Kleenex. Trouble. The rest is up to you. Ashes. Ashes dead. No! 
It can't be! Luke, say it's not true! <laughs> Look out! It's a trap! Natalia, we have to run! I... I... Natalia! Ugh. We won't make it! Damn it! Not like this! Ash, help me! What happened? Hyperresonance, no. Second order hyperresonance? Impossible. What was that power? I... I don't know. But the moment I thought about Ash, something in me just... It was like when I destroyed Axarioth. But I think I can actually control it. A second order hyper-resonance? You've got to be joking! Ah, it's Sink! Sink! Even with Yulia's divine protection, power like that could harm Van. You have two choices. Hand over the key and join Van, or die. I choose neither. I'm freeing Lorelei. And to do that, I will defeat Master Van. And you. Sink, you're a replica, just like Ion. Why are you helping a project like this? I'm not like him. You know that. Ion. The seventh Ion was a naive child. He believed the score was merely one possible choice for the future. But in the end, he couldn't oppose the score. Phone Master Ion will die. That was the planet's memory. Your Ion died like a dog. Take that back! No! It's the truth! Whoops. But Van's plan will destroy Lorelei itself, and with it, the seventh Phonon. The score will truly vanish. Do you really hate the score that much? I was born because the score dictated that Phone Master Ion would die. You already know that I was thrown away once. That's why you hate the score? Because you were thrown away? Because I was born. I'm not even a substitute like you. I was born a piece of meat. If the score hadn't existed, I wouldn't have been stuck with this pathetic life. Are you saying you gained nothing since you were born? Not a thing. I'm empty. But it doesn't matter. I didn't care who it was, as long as they would erase the score, the seventh phonon. I may be inferior, but my power of the seventh phonon is that of the phone master. You would know if I unleashed my full power. Let's test it. You or the empty me. Let's see which side this world wants to survive. For boss time against Seek for the final time. So, how is it that the world looks just like Zion? Shut up! You are nothing compared to him. You might look the same, but you are not Zion. You didn't want to be part of the Master's replacement, did you? <laughs> are you trying to tell me that I am who I am? I told you I am nothing. My existence means nothing. Seek, that's not true. You don't really believe that, do you? For someone who thinks they mean nothing. Sure like to fight for your life. You will not change me. I stand tall. I'm tired of this world. Everyone can die along with it. Screw it up. Alright. Now let's use this on him. Ion's not too much more difficult. Not Ion. Sink is not too much more difficult than he was when we first fought him. His stats have increased a bit more. He has a little bit more HP. I think he also gained a couple new arts. But we can handle him. And that's the one you gotta watch out for. Stone Dragon Ascent is one of them. Ha <laughs> ha 
Now, what do you think you're doing here, Sink? Oh, he's almost dead. Um. Watch out! No! Do nothing! There we go. I just wanted to make sure everybody got experience. <laughs> he wasn't too bad. We get a mystic symbol. How much grade did we lose? We got 1057. That's not too bad. Oh, yeah. Oh, yay. Luke learned add skill HP recovery. And I do believe that means any uh, item he's given that heals him will do a little bit more. Oh. Natalia learned a bunch. Comeback, dash guard, and resilience. So let's see. We lost 1.33, 2.33, 2.33 grade. Not too bad. Destroy Lorelei. All right, all his minions are dead. There's only Van. They're all laying down their lives for Master Van's vision. Don't let them get to you. We're doing the same for ours, right? Yeah. Ash, too. Ash really is dead, isn't he? Natalia, I'm sorry. If I'd stayed with him. <gasps> Slap the dog dick out of her. Ow. What was that for? Ah, yes. This was 2005. It was a different time. Your actions have been a nuisance to us all. And to Ash. To Ash? Ash fought so Luke could kill Van. Even if that wasn't his original intention. What you did interfered with that. I'm sorry. You're free to care about Ash, but you must not forget what you came Tell to Tell her, Jade! Yes, you're right. I'm truly sorry. I'm not the only one who's suffering. If only it was Teary slapped up instead of, uh... Natalia. Anis and Guy both lost people dear to them. And Tear must... Exactly. Jade! You called that a second-order hyper-resonance, right? Yes, but the theory behind second-order hyper-resonance hasn't yet been established. It's said that when two hyper-resonances interact, they neutralize the effects of all phonons. I don't know what this power is, but if it is second-order hyper-resonance, then it was Ash who gave it to me, right? He and I are the only ones who can cause a hyper-resonance. Yes, Ash is inside you. Ah, that's kind of sus. Ash accepted you and gave you his power. Yeah, I've got to put up a fight worthy of him. Guys, lend me your strength. My friends are my power. Hey, hey, and after that, we now have the Key of Lorelei weapon. And we get the Swordsman of Lorelei title. We're going to get a bunch of skits, but before... Well, let's get them before... Uh, sink, you idiot. Anis? Tear? What? What? You don't have to look so worried. I'm doing fine. Just fine. Anis, it's okay. Seek, you idiot. Looking just like Ion, sounding just like him, but so mean and twisted.
I hate you! I didn't want to see Ion die anymore! You went on about being so lonely and empty, and then you went and died. It's okay, Annis. You can cry. Sick, you idiot! Ash's death? Ash, how could you die like that? I just never thought that you would die. Ash, I wish I could have seen you one more time. Yeah, the rest of us never did see him on Eldrant. Luke, I don't I know this is a painful question, but how did Ash die? Surrounded by Oracle soldiers with swords thrust through his body. Ash! Did you feel anything enter you after that? Now that you mention it, there was a feeling like something warm falling onto me. Did you feel anything leave you? Huh? Well, when Ash died, I felt a little weak, but other than that... I see. What was that about, Jade? Nothing. Nothing at all. Why won't you say things, Jade? Why don't you inform us? I love Jade, but Jesus, he's freaking infuriating. Alright. Now, let us go back and look at this new weapon we got. The Key of Lorelei. I think it is second only to his Soul Crush weapon. But the Key of Lorelei is required to do a another Mystic Art with Luke. Anyways, we want to come to the left of, the, of that little platform and come back this way. And we get a red sage. Now, I'm going to do something that's weird. I'm about to leave. And return. To the world map. Uh, we could go inside and start taking care of that. But I need more items. Especially life bottles. So, I'm going to go ahead and cut until we get to the world map, so I will see you soon. I'll do whatever it takes. So, I'm not back to the, uh... I've not restocked on my supplies yet, but I wanted to cut in right here real quick because Anna's learned the aerial jump add skill. And I've also run out of rice, so I'm now cooking ramen. With Natalia, Natalia's actually miscooked twice. Alright, I will see you guys either with the next abilities, next add skills I learn, or when I get back to the uh, world map. So see you soon. Alright, we have re turn to the world map and there is no skit all right golly this skit was supposed to appear the moment you left um eldrin but for whatever reason it took me going to several different places and then finally arriving here at Kessedonia to restock on some supplies to get it and the skit is after defeating Van. Even after we take care of the Commandant, there's so much left to do. Well, yeah, there's lots to do as long as you're alive. We have to rebuild Kim Laska and think about how to support the replicas. The Order of Lorelei is falling apart too. I've got to help put it together. Malku too, especially since we've lost part of our land. 
Yes, indeed. But that's better than worrying about who we have to kill next. Yeah, really. I hope this world remains where we can work to help people. One where we can work to help people. Alright, and you know, this video was going pretty long. It's already going to be long as it is. So, when I come back, I will see you guys back at that healing safe point next time. Let's play Tales of the Abyss 100%. This is Joseph K. signing out. Y'all, have a great day, and keep it real. Later.